The Yankees hosting the Red Sox, as well as 111-year-old Fernando Lopolo, a lifelong Yankee fan, having a chat with Derek Jeter during batting practice. John Farrell's crew looking to stay in first place in the American League East. Third inning action here, Phil Hughes facing Mike Carp. Carp hits one down the left field line, and it lands just fair. Jackie Bradley Jr. scores on the RBI double. It's 1-0 Boston. And take another look at where this ball landed, right on the left field line, and that's how Boston gets on the board first. Now, later in the frame, with men on second and third, the Yankees elect to intentionally walk David Ortiz. That would load the bases up for Mike Napoli, and Joe Girardi's move does not pay off. Swing and a fly ball, right center field, hit well. Back it goes toward the wall. Gardner jumps, it's gone. A grand slam into the right center field seats for Mike Napoli, and the Red Sox take a 5-0 lead. Napoli's second grand slam of the year. The fifth of his career, and it's 5 nothing Boston. WEEI provides the call on the Napoli slam. Felix Dubron starting for Boston on Saturday. Bottom three, he'll strike out Kevin Euclid looking. Then two batters later, Mark Deshera goes down looking. The Yankees don't score in the frame. Bottom five, it's 5-1 to one Boston. Again, Euclid strikes out, this time on a check swing. And two batters after that, Mark Deshera goes down swinging. Dubron, six innings, one earned run, and six strikeouts. Top of the eighth now, still a 5-1 Boston lead until Daniel Navas steps in with two on against Adam Morris. There goes Bradley again, swinging a high fly ball. This is driven deep to right field. That's way, way back. Forget about it. Gone, a home run. A three-run shot for Daniel Nava. His eighth of the season, and the Red Sox have blown this one open and now lead it 8-1. to one. WEEI provides the call once again. Nava ties career highs with four hits and four RBIs in this ballgame. Top nine now, Stephen Drew will provide some insurance as he takes Adam Warren deep to right center field. His fourth home run of the year, the Red Sox score three runs in both the eighth and ninth innings and route the Yankees by a final of 11-1. to So the Red Sox even up their series in the Bronx and extend their AL East lead back to two games. Felix Dubron gets the win. He's now 4-2 and two on the year. And Jacoby Ellsbury misses a second straight game with tightness in his left groin.